Hey guys, welcome to vtshacademy.com and here in this presentation we are going to discuss about conjunction. In our previous video we have discussed about statements. So here in this presentation let us learn about conjunction. So this statement that uses the connective and is called as a conjunction. And this statement P and Q can be denoted by P and Q. We can also define conjunction with the help of a truth table. So here we have three columns. The first two columns gives the truth values for P and Q and the last column gives the truth value for P and Q. And here if both the statements P and Q are the true statements then the truth value for P and Q is also a true statement. And if P is true and Q is a false statement then the truth value for P and Q would come as false. And if P is a false statement and Q is a true statement then the truth value for P and Q is false statement. And if both the statements P and Q is a false statement then the truth value for P and Q would also be a false statement. Now let me explain this concept with the help of an example over here. So here we have this statement 20 divided by 10 is equal to 2 and 20 into 10 is equal to 200. Here we observe that both the statements are true statements so the truth value for the connection of the both the statements would also be a true statement. Let us consider another example. So here we have 10 plus 1 is equal to 11 and 10 divided by 2 is equal to 20. So here the first statement is true and the second statement is false so the truth value for both the statements would come as false. In our next example we have the statement as 10 plus 15 is equal to 20 and 15 minus 10 is equal to 5. So here the first statement is false as we know 10 plus 15 is equal to 25 and the second statement is true. So the conjunction of both the statements would also be a false statement. Let us consider another example. So here we have the first statement as 15 3 times is 14 and 15 plus 3 is equal to 6. So here we observe that both the statements are the false statements as 15 3 times is 45 and 15 plus 3 is equal to 18. So the conjunction here would be a false statement. And now let us move to another example. So here we have the statement A as Robin is a tall person and we have the statement B as Ricky is very intelligent. Now let us find the truth value for A and B. So first let us draw a truth table of three columns. So here the first two columns gives the truth value for A and B and the third column gives the truth value for conjunction statement A and B. So if both the statements A and B are the true statements then the conjunction of A and B would be a true statement. And if A is true and B is false then the conjunction of A and B would be a false statement. And here both A and B are the false statements then the truth value for the conjunction A and B would be a false statement. And if A is a false statement and B is a true statement then the truth value for A and B would come as false statement. So this was the basic introduction on conjunction. Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vtshacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.